I'm Michael Goulian, and I first soloed an airplane before I could drive a car. I've been lucky enough to fly air shows all around North America, and I've raced in the Red Bull Air Race World Championship around the globe. My wife and I also own and operate Mike Goulian Aviation, a Cirrus training center based in Plymouth, Massachusetts, near beautiful Cape Cod. So subscribe to our channel and come along for a journey of passion, dedication, and excellence as I bring you behind the scenes and inside the cockpit of some of the most amazing airplanes and air shows in the world. You can also follow my wife Karen's journey to get her instrument rating in our beautiful Cirrus SR22. So again, the best thing is just to start at the top, right? So yeah. put your altitude that's expected in there. You can expect 2,000 on departure, right? And you can probably, and then put your, yeah, hold on. 30, these are one five. And that corresponds with the field elevation at the airport, doesn't it? Yes, it so does. So that's yeah. the right yeah, number. It Great. Here. Okay. So while you're doing it, and go ahead and put your heading on like okay. 120, because that's usually the first heading on takeoff out of Plymouth. Okay. Okay. Great. Okay. And then set up your flight plan. Yeah, oh, great. Great. Six zero put six in. Yeah. And then we we filed for Bovkey, right? So just put it in there so the airplane has somewhere to go. Nice. Okay, great. So now you want to again you want to talk to ground on the number two radio like we always do, right? So yeah. you actually want twenty seven seventy five on the number two. Oh, radio. you do. Okay, I didn't yep. realize that. Okay. Yep. All right. And do you want to try to get the clearance yourself and read it back yourself? For the first time? No. <laughs> Come on. Uh, no, I think it's a bad idea. Why don't you try? So all you're gonna do is you're just gonna call them up. Yeah. And you're gonna say, "Good morning, Boston. Boston Cirrus 199 Mike Golf, on the ground at Plymouth, looking for the round robin IFR back to Plymouth." And if you screw it up and you need help, I'll read it for you. So don't worry. There's okay. no big deal. Okay? Okay. All right, try it. Good morning, Boston. Cirrus 199 Mike Golf on the ground at Plymouth. Looking for the IFR round robin back to Plymouth. There you go. Boom. Boom. Number 199 Mike Golf, Boston Approach. Uh, you cleared round, round robin to the Plymouth Airport via radar vectors. On departure, maintain 2,000. Expect 3,000 in five minutes departure. Departure frequency 118.2, squawk 5370, hold for release. Okay. Okay, 199 Mike Golf, we're clear for the round robin back to Plymouth via radar vectors 2000, expect 3005, 118.2, 5370. Boom! Hold for release. Golf, back correct, hold for release, advise this frequency number one, ready for departure. Okay, 199 Mike Golf, we'll hold for release and uh, let you know we're ready. we'll let you know when you're ready. Oh my, God, oh my God, that, that was, was so hard. <laughs> so hard. Somehow you survived. Survived. Hey everybody, welcome aboard 199 Mike Golf. This is going to be Karen's first experience, I think, in a little bit of actual IFR conditions. It's about 700 broken outside and I can see some higher overcast, so I'm not sure how much we'll get, but it will be kind of fun. We're just going to stay here, uh, round robin clearance around the Plymouth Airport. We'll kind of hopefully do an ILS and then try it again to do a RNAV to a full stop. So let's see how it goes. Okay, so we're going to take off uh, with a standard flaps 50 uh, takeoff on runway 6. 70, 40, 05, say, we need uh, 2,000 feet. Uh, we have 4650 available to 
Yeah, so there's no wind. There's no wind. If you so have a if you have a problem before you enter the clouds, stay below the clouds. Okay, right. Right? Yeah. And what what might that be? The oil door opens. There's oil coming on the cowling. The door opens. The flaps don't retract. And the engine Anything. starts making a funny sound, right? Don't go into the weather if you're below the weather. Right. And now we know that all runways are available to us because there's no wind. Okay. That's the most important okay. thing that you have to get in your mind, right? Okay. I didn't check the note up to see if the runway is closed. No, the note that I did, and the runway is open. Oh, open. Okay. Got okay. It. Okay. So your takeoff is going to be pretty probably as as depicted by ATC, but you're going to go up to 2,000, and you'll probably fly a heading of 120. We'll see what they say. Okay. All right. All right so let's move up and hold short. <laughs> Boston, Cirrus 199 Mike Golf, holding short runway 6 at Plymouth, ready for departure. Number 9 Mike Golf, release for departure, enter control air space, flooding 120, maintain 2000. Okay, 199 Mike Golf, we'll uh, take off heading 120, maintain 2000. Release, or, for release for departure. That was pretty good. You don't want to say we're going to take off on a heading 120. What he All said right. was enter control the airspace on a heading 120, right? Okay, yeah. But so it's the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so okay. boost pump, boost mixture, mixture, flaps, flaps and lights, and light. switches. Man, this thing's light today, huh? Yeah. <laughs> it's a missile. Nice. 102, is that okay? Oh, yeah, it's great. Okay, now you're flying IFR, right? Yeah. Just keep. Now, you need a lot of right rudder there, baby. That's better. Okay. Fly it in the command bars. Yep. Okay. Heading flight level change right at 120. See that? I see that. 600. Caps available. Okay. Okay. Departure frequency now. And what are you going to tell them? Say Boston Center, Sirius 199 Mike Golf. Boston Center, Sirius 199 Mike Golf. Morning, Boston. 199 Mike Golf. Off of Plymouth, out of 1.4 for 2000 on a 120 heading. I'm going to remember all that. You got to tell them. Well, it's easy. Just tell them. Okay. Boston. Boston. Good morning, Boston. You got to hurry up, though. Good morning, Boston. Sirius 199 Mike Golf. We're just off of Plymouth at 1800 to 2000 on a 120 heading. Here's 199 Mike Golf, Boston approach, good morning, identical, maintain 3000. Uh, claim maintain 3000, 199 Mike Golf, is the identical. Okay, so 3000. Number 99 Mike Golf, radar contact, 3 miles east of Plymouth, cable altimeter at 3015. 3015 for Mike Golf, and uh, if it's okay, what we do, like vectors around to the ILS to runway 6 to start within of the published mist. Care 531, cleared visual approach, runway 6, contact Nantucket Tower. So look at your scoreboard. Just look at your scoreboard. How do I do it, Michael? Okay, so go to flight level change. Never would enter Mike Golf. Turn right. Scroll to 120. Vectors for the ILS 6. Right to 220 for Michael. Okay, go to 120. Actually, 130 is fine. You're only going up 1,000 feet. Okay. Okay, right 220. Right, 220. Right, 220. I'm behind the plane. 220 is right here. That's it. Nice. Different story in the clouds, right? Uh, yeah. So now you have to get set up for the approach. Yeah. Okay? So, procedure. Wherever that is, yeah. Select, Select approach. approach. ILS to six. six. 
and we actually are going to do vectors, so you can do it. We don't normally do this, but That's since it's sure close, turn, uh, vectors are fine. The vector minimums, eight. you can do it here if you want. Zero, three, zero, five, so just scroll to turn it on, the little knob. Now the big knob to the right. And what are your minimums for the ILS to six? 345, right? Yes. Okay. Put 345. Okay, 350 is good. Enter and load it. Perfect. Okay. okay. So now I need you to, we'll slow down. So go to like 40% power because you're way behind the plane. Yeah, I am. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, where do you go? Steep turn ahead. I got you there, buddy. Okay. So brief me the approach or I'm going to brief it for you. I'd like Remember you to fly the autopilot. I'm going to shut the autopilot off. I just want you to fly the plane because it's nice in the clouds, okay? Okay. So, we're going to do the ILS to runway 6 at Plymouth. Yep. It's loaded, okay? And it's even identified. We're going to intercept inside of Bove Key, probably at 2,000 feet. Good afternoon. 0, 5, 6 degrees inbound. Going down to 345, which is 200 feet above, and it's bugged, okay? The mist approach, which is what we're going to do, is a climb to 600, then a climbing right turn to 2,000 feet, and we'll uh, fly the mist, okay? Okay. And I'm going to tell them we're ready, and they're going to re see where we are. We're on a big downwind here, right? Yeah. Turn on 47 okay. and 718, 5,000, and fly heading uh, 170, back to final. 5,000 heading 170, yeah, that's good for 47. You know. 47, running already to cancel. We can cancel uh, IFR in the air on this frequency or on the ground. <laughs> Little different, right? Yeah. <laughs> and Mike Golf's ready for the turn. No, no, Mike Golf, turn right heading uh, 320. Right 320 for Mike Golf. Okay, so now, like we talked about, you are now on the base leg for the turn, right? So, you can activate the so procedure. Just now, 3 sure, Papa, turn left, I'm heading 120. Yep, one, absolutely, because you're going to have to do it. Procedure, and we'll go to it says, activate vector spinal, press enter. Boom. And it turns you into a green needle now, doesn't it? Yes. Okay, great. So what should your power and your setting be and your speed here on the base? Uh, 120. 120, so we said 40% is yeah. 120. Right? And if you look at your glide path, you're already right there. So he's going to descend you in a minute, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, he is. Nicely done. Hello, Providence, Navajo 35580. But he might not. He might have you just intercept from right here, okay? Okay. So no, this is how knowing your power zero, settings zero, is good. Yeah. 120 is 40%, right? Yeah. And look at it going. Make sure it's trimmed. Nice. Nicely done. Brickyard 4467, at the start. Southwest 2170, contact tower. November 199, Mike Golf, 6 miles from the final approach, fixed, turn right, heading 030, maintain 3000, we'll establish some local address, good ILS, and we're 6 Okay, 3000 till established 030 on the heading, and we're cleared for the approach for Michael. Okay, so he said cleared for the approach, what do you do? One Bravo 9. Right here. Right here. No, 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 approach. Gentle, go slow to go fast. Got go it. slow to go fast. Okay. Okay. So this heading that he gave you, Careful where's the wind control coming control from? Control it's control. coming from here, right? Oh, here. Oh, okay. So you're going to be good. So the wind's going to slide you into the needle, isn't it? Yeah. So what are we looking for? We've got heading, altitude, localizer, and glide soap are armed, but they're not active, right? Okay. So we're now waiting for this get, you gotta get captured, and then that'll turn action. green, okay? So since we're cleared for the approach, we can turn for the approach and descent and all Yeah, that. we are cleared for the approach. Okay. Okay, your speed's nice, right? 120. Yeah. Yep. Your glide path's coming down. It's gonna, gonna turn green in a second, right? Uh, 3, Look at localizer. You just follow the command bars. Yeah. Okay. Now the lo now the act, the, it's a, the uh, approach is set, right? Yep. Gonna do that for you. Nice. We're going down to 350 feet, right? Yeah. Okay. You want me to set that? You already did. 
when we loaded the approach, we set it, didn't we? Papa, four miles from the right final here. approach, fix, turn left, heading zero, eight, eight, zero, maintain 2,000. No, 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 that's we'll not doing anything. Remember yeah. we talked about that when yeah. we did ground oh, school? Yeah, zero, eight, zero, maintain 2,000, so establish a clear for the ILS 5 approach, 3 Sierra Papa. Remember the missed no, approach is two. Remember 9 Mike Golf, change to advisory frequencies approved, see you. Order advisory for Mike Golf, thanks, Kitty. Okay. And there, what, remember what we said? Flaps right in here, the airplane will balloon right up into it. Okay, ready? Yes, ma'am. Flight slope's captured. 20%. From the traffic, Cirrus 199, Mike Offs on the ILS runway 6 outside of Aid, and we're going to shoot the public's mist. Okay, nicely done. Beautiful. Fly the airplane. Keep it in the command bars. Right? Yep. Good. Looking great, kid. Keep it in the command bars. Yeah, I'm trying. That's it. Got to fly the airplane. I'm trying. Keep it in the command bars. Come on. Small ah. corrections. Small yep. corrections. Yep. Looking good. Very nice. Got me all over the A sky here. A little bumpy. No, it's fine. That's hey, That's part of being in the clouds. Yeah. How's the trim? Okay, very nice. That's nice good. job. Nice job. The missed approach altitude is 2,000 feet. I'm going to bug it for you because you're behind the plane. I just want you to fly the plane. Okay. Okay. So remember the mist. Toga. Toga. Power. Positive rate. Flaps. Nav. Right? Yeah. Now I'll, I'll, I'll talk you through it. Okay. So remember, we've got a long way to go to the runway. We're two, still 2,000 feet in the air, Yeah. right? Speed's good, about 110, I like it. Some people shoot at 100. It went in New England, in the, in the in New York, Boston area, they'll, they won't let you fly it at 100 knots. They'll lose Flying their mind. Faster. Yeah, because you've got a Gulfstream behind you doing 160 yeah. or right. 140 or 130. Yep. So it's about 750, 700 feet a minute. Yeah. Right, you got a nice headwind. From the traffic, Cirrus 199 Mike Offs on the ILS runway 6, just crossing IED will be a published missed approach, but a uh, four mile final. Like it. I like it. Okay, can I do a uh, boost check pump? Here? Boost pump, mixture, flaps, lights, and switches. Good to go. Keep flying the plane, that's the most important thing. Yep. Stay in the command bars. Trying You're in a left bank. Something that's me. better. Yep. As Sergey Boryak would say, Michael, fly as required. Yeah. Don't give me excuses. Fly as required. <laughs> but Sergey, it's bumpy. I don't care it's bumpy. It's not bumpy in my chair watching you. Okay. 1350 for 350. 1000 above minimums. So you're on the localizer and you're on the glide slope. Yeah. And you can look Aid to runway 6 miss approach point up there, right? Yeah. Great. Keep so your head inside. 345 was the missed approach. Yeah, 350 is what we're going to do it at. And for the traffic, Cirrus 1 on Amarok Office on a bay, uh, three mile final on the ILS 6, we'll be doing the published miss. So 850 for 350, 500 to go, right? Yeah. And right here, if we were going to land, we'd put the flaps out. Pull okay. flaps, yeah. slow the airplane down for a nice landing, right? Yeah. Which we'll do on the next one, but not this one. Okay. 400 above minimums. 500. Okay, 500, we've got boost pump, mixture, flaps, lights, and switches. Yep. Okay, 300 above minimums. You can see the little cyan minimum sky coming up, right? Yeah. Keep it inside, keep looking. 200 above minimums now. I want you to keep your head right inside. Okay. On the swivel. Here comes minimums, you ready? Not yet. Minimum. Now, Minimums. Toga, toga. Power all the way up. Go, 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 go. Pitch the plane into the command bars. Don't hit the ground. Positive rate. Flaps. Navigate. Nav. Okay. Nav. Fly the airplane. See, it says heading 056. So it even knows. Yep. From the traffic, Cirrus 199, Mike Golf is on the uh, misapproach. Just fly the public's mist. 
Boston, good afternoon. Sirius 199, Mike off off the uh, published missed out of play. Absolutely. Remember, 199, under Mike off off the departure radar contact. I'm going to maintain 3,000. How long do you plan to hold that trail? Okay, 3,000. We're just going to do one spin in the hold, and then just like the uh, RNAV to, to 6, we'll make it a full stop for you. Remember, under Mike off, copy on. Thank you. Okay. Now, you want to just press your heading bug to put it at the top. Good. Very nice. You're ahead of the plane. Keep it up. November Niner Mike Golf, turn right, direct to Meta, track the approach inbound. Tell him. Okay. Uh, not Mike Golf, direct to Meta. November Niner Mike Golf, just verify this is a full stop. Affirmative for Mike Golf. Okay, so you did something wrong. Karen, hold on, hold on. Go slow to go fast. Yeah. Direct Meta. Correct. Direct Enter. Meta. Enter. The worst thing to do in an airplane is to start pressing buttons when you're not sure what you're doing. Okay? okay. Now look. You GPS, pressed, yeah. it's like, confirm, direct Meta, nav, make sure the autopilot's going to Meta. Come down here, sync your heading bug. Good. Okay? Okay. Make sense? Yeah. Don't hit buttons just to hit buttons. Okay. I guess okay. I was confused because we already hit the direct Meta, and I know I should have done it again because we were way off of that direct line. Well, we were flying a heading. Yeah. So, turn 95, turn <laughs> we got Meta, we went marker. direct Meta to prepare the airplane we wanted to get inside the the approach, right? Yeah, because so we're not we went, cleared for the approach yet. He just said he did, didn't he? He said, tr well, he didn't say we're clear for the approach, no. but he said track the approach, right? Okay. So that means, so if you look down to your approach, there's Meta. Yep. The airplane's going to turn 90 degrees and fly that leg inbound, right? See it? See the T? Where's Meta on here? Right oh, here. Oh, yeah, okay. That makes sense? Yes, I see it. Okay. Never mind, under my golf, maintain 3,000 until established on the final approach course. Cleared RNAV 6 approach, Plymouth Airport. 3,000 until established, clear for the approach. Uh, not my golf, and 3,000 until established on the approach. And we're clear for the approach. Right. Never mind, under my golf, thank you. Okay, we're clear for the approach, right? What should your speed be? 120. Okay, slow down to 120. Okay, do you see? Above key, 3,000 then you're going to intercept the glide path, right? Okay. Okay, you're going to turn right. pretty soon, right? Yeah. Your next set. This is the final approach heading, isn't it? Yes. Okay. Boom. Nice. There it goes. See, when the airplane is nice and set up, how, how well it works, yeah, right? Yeah, it really does. By the command bars, you're going to get off heading. I'm trying to make small changes. Yeah, but you, you okay, but just make lots of small changes, right? Yeah. yeah. So what are you waiting for now? I'm waiting for the glide path to right. come down, and when it's right here, I'll put the flaps down. Correct. Nice. And what's your power setting? Gonna uh, be coming down, down the approach. 20, right? Yeah, 15 to 20. See the glide path coming down? Yeah. Do I do it after I put the flaps down or before? Do what? Power. That's up to you. Chair 53, contact tennis tower. It's raining outside. Here it comes. Boom. Let it balloon a little bit. It's got a capture. About 20. There you go. Glide path captured, right? Yeah. What's your power setting? 20%. Otherwise, you're going to get a big speed increase as right? you yeah. dip the nose, right? Okay, great. Little baby corrections, lots and lots of them. Remember, as you get closer to the runway, it gets more sensitive, right? Yeah. You're in a left-hand bank. You love a left-hand bank, and then you get left of course, right? Yeah. Nice. Kim Z882, Boston. What altitude are you going to go down to? to? I'm going to maintain 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, Yeah, good. You're in the clouds for a while. This is great.
Plymouth Traffic Series 1 and now Michael on about a 5 mile final runway 6 Plymouth full stop. Okay. 37. 537 KF 5510. Why are you holding that? Boston Sears, now to Mike Golf's canceling the IFR and the bases are about 1.7. They're broken. Sears, now to Mike Golf, IFR cancellation is received. Squawk 1200, thanks for the pirate. Welcome, thanks. Have a great day. Appreciate your help this morning. Anytime, sir. Okay, 1,000 above the minimums and yeah. you're uh, pretty much on the glide path and on, on the uh, course. Why don't you slow us down a little bit more, because I want you to put out full flaps now, because you're going to land out of this. Yeah. And the weather's good enough where you can put full flaps out. Okay. From the traffic, Sears 199, Mike Golf's on about a two-mile final on the r and runway. Six will be a full stop. From traffic, A4 Bravo, turning okay, try to maintain a, Trying to maintain like 100 knots. 100 knots? So 20. What's your power setting? 20. You told me to slow down. Yeah, to put the flaps down because you weren't in the white arc. Oh, I see. You're inside of 500 to go. 90's fine. That's why I don't like I'm using it. not allowed to look outside yet. 500. No. 500 feet. We got boost pump, mixture, flaps, light switches, the autopilot's off. The I'm traffic is our battle left midfield runway 6 from it. Your speed's good. See how hard it is to maintain your speed with full flaps? It's one of the reasons yeah. I don't like full flaps on these approaches. Yeah. Did they but know you're doing right. final? Yeah, they're fine. They're over there somewhere. And there is a final for runway 6. How far are you? Minimums. On a Minimums. very short final. Okay, right. start to slow the airplane. We got your time. Power, 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 power. You don't need any power. Great. You're looking for the first thousand foot marker, the fixed distance marker, all the way down there, aren't you? Because we're gonna fly, I, we're gonna continue the glide path. Nice, the ODEP's clear, we're three greens in a row, we have full flaps. Hold it off, give me a nice landing now. More, more. That's perfect right there, perfect. No, more, 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 oh yeah, I love it, I love it. More, more, back, 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 back. Oh, so nice, please. Now gently on the brakes. You're gonna make a left turn.